sky dissolve but for a breath, while all around scattered memories release their choking grip. I ascend as if slipping off a promontory with intent to become liquid like the bellicose sea that taunts me below. But I am lifted as if by the wake of a multitude of seraphim, lifted, anointed, and kissed with power, with visions and melodies both ancient and new, none unknown to me. The siren gazes at me and beckons my surrender, longs to see me washed upon a broken shore where foamy currents caress my naked form, covered in the rain of a thousand sorrows. I close my eyes and envision my lover's fierce gaze, her mantle of calm and mantra of hope challenging me to rise up. She dreams of me born anew into a celestial embrace where our wordless vows replace the empty choruses that have filled up so many idle disenchantments. The siren reaches out as if to taunt me. Seduction and melody, scent and design, all matter of dread. Yet even as I plunge, I am lifted ever higher away from her tormented grasp. I feel her desperation as she lunges in a last effort to derail my fate. My lover sits calm upon a cloud, lifting me, inviting me in with the music of her laughter. Locked in my dreamer's eyes, she leads me this never-ending storyline, this sunset of all my yesterdays that succumbs to the dawn of all our tomorrows, while the mute ghosts of sirens dissolve into desultory shadows. The fate that paints the colors of my being vibrates with a new and vital urgency, connected by one who knows who makes her dancing entrance right on cue.